Welcome to What's in the Box, film at 11. Hey everybody, Rick Stromeyer. Thanks for joining us at Art and Toy Theory today. Today we have an exciting what's in the box. This came all the way from Japan. Let's note that today is July 23rd in the year of our quarantine. And this was ordered, this was on a release of about April 25th. It's the same day we got paid. <laughs> And it took, Puka is now five months old and 39 pounds. So this took about three months to get here. And I'm really excited to. First off, there's no ill will about the idea that how long it took to get here because I mean, we're, all in, we're all screwed. So this is Tokyo Jesus. Let's, open, let's crack it open and see what we got. I'm excited. Now, of course, before we keep going, sometime during this, after after the order and, and Japan started closing down uh, or shutting down some of its shipping, uh, Tokyo Jesus was really cool about going on to his Instagram and his social media and, and saying, hey, you know, we're screwed or things are shut, slowed down and it was really nice for, for him to give an update like that uh, any company that does that during this time is greatly appreciated so let's see what we got Ooh. boxes all right uh, all right aha and paper more paper Little tiny boxes. One small box. Two small box. Oh, hard on. I always like to have a I'm comparing toy sizes, I always like to have a dunny next to it. Dunny is always the is the universal scale of how big something is. And then the next size up would be Tech 63. So let's talk about what we got here. We got oh my gosh, I'm gonna forget how the we got two of these guys, two of these guys, and he threw in, because he knew the delay, orders were going to be delayed, he threw in a complimentary doctor. And let's open the doctor first and see how that looks. And we're going to, after opening all these, we're going to switch camera label, uh, camera labels, camera levels, angles, and take a closer examination. So we got a doctor. And then we got, oh, this is the, uh, not the, the baffle mat. And I went with all the blank ones. Um, you guys know me. I buy blank so I can paint it. Oh, look at that, dude. I'm going to spare you opening the other two duplicates right now, but we'll look at them all when I change the camera angle. Uh, and this little dude. All right. He's like a freaking undead Ewok. He's awesome. So we got this little dude. This guy. And then the doctor. 
All right, first up is the baffle mat. This is, I'm just flooding out the details. All right, first up is the baffle mat, and let's see. He stands an amazing four inches tall compared with the dunny. That's pretty big. He's got a good weight to him in terms of salt being solid resin. Well, I say he, and he's got boobs, um, but it's all one solid piece. There's no articulation. This survived being jostled around at the post office. They both did. Um, and they've got all kinds of cool hair texture. The antlers are incredibly well detailed. Um, you got your stylized skull face from Tokyo Jesus. And... Uh, He's got little balls. There you go. That's why it's a he. And uh, yeah, this will this will be this will paint up really well. It fits well in the hand. It goes. It's a four finger toy, and uh, yeah, fantastic. Next up is the Gaki, and let's do the size comparison to the Dunny. This is a three inch Dunny, by the way. But no, it's an eight inch Dunny, and this thing's fucking massive. So this has your undead Ewok look. No, it's not. Uh, but that's what I totally think of all the time. This should be a really fun piece to, to paint as well. Again, it's solid resin, no articulation, and yeah, it feels good in the hand. It's, it's a great size. And finally, we have the Doctor. So this one is smaller than the Donnie. He goes up to right about where the top of the head is. And he is detailed as hell. What the actual dimension is on this. So he's just over two inches tall, or just about two inches tall. Got a little skull on his hat. He's got the plague doctor look going on, which is totally appropriate for, for this day and age. Uh, he has a similar body build as the Gaki the toes, the hands, the belly. Um, that cloak, that should be really cool to paint. Well, it's enough to put a mural on there. Yeah, this is just a fun one. It's, it's appreciated to have like just a free or a, 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 I don't know if it's a mea culpa, but I appreciate getting something, a bonus piece. All right, this concludes our broadcast session. If you enjoyed what you saw here, feel free to subscribe to the channel and, for all, and hit the bell button for all the updates. You can also follow me on Instagram for... Chances are I'm going to prime these in the next week or so, and you can follow me on Instagram to see the progress of these being sold.